Hey guys, it's the most electrifying woman in travel blogging, Katie from The Katie Show blog here, and today we're exploring the Okanichi Speedway Trail pronunciation, maybe. Uh, so forgive if I've just butchered that with my Australian uh, accent. I'm not 100% sure how to pronounce it, but it is a really cool place, about two hours drive from Fayetteville. And I'm actually here on a family day, and I usually don't vlog on family time, right? It, it, it's very isolating. Uh, so, what I'm gonna do is film this intro, give you a couple couple of quick tips, and then I'll get a bunch of clips together and put them there so you can see everything and just type over any important information over the clips. But if you want even more information, I write detail guides on my website, and that's where you can get just way more details on everything I do, anything you see in these videos, and way more. So I'll leave a link in the description. You can check that out if you want more details. But otherwise, we're gonna do a quick sort of video overview of this really cool place. Now what makes this cool, and what I think makes it especially cool if you have kids, is that it's an actual old speedway, and around the speedway track, they have a couple of old cars there on the trail. So you can walk around, you're getting in Nature, you're getting outside and it's a fun place to walk and get some energy out of the kids but you also have these cool cars to see and the old buildings from the speedway so it has that historical and adventure element as well the speedway itself area only takes like an hour to walk around so it's not very long uh, but then there's a lot of other walking trails in the area so the one I'm on now is actually a different one and there's maps everywhere there's trail markings so it's really easy to find your way around everywhere what you're gonna do to get here is just put it into Google Maps it'll take you straight here and then the parking's free, it's really well signed. Once you get here, just walk directly back from the parking lot and you'll just go straight into the speedway trails and you'll come across the maps, so they'll point out where you are and you'll be able to find your way around. even more things to do to fill your Fayetteville chapter with adventures, check out my Fort Bragg bucket list, which has a whole heap of adventures, long weekend ideas, um, events you don't want to miss while you're living here. So it's going to make it easy to fill your weekends and fill this chapter with adventure. You're not going to be one of those people who gets to the end of your time being stationed here and goes, oh, I haven't seen anything. What can I do here? You're going to be able to fill those weekends. So I'll leave a link for the description uh, in the description for that as well. So I hope that helps you plan your adventure out here. Like I said, check out the links in the description for my detailed guides and my Fort Bragg bucket list. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up button. Don't forget to tell YouTube you like the video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And we'll bring you more adventures in North Carolina. Otherwise, that's about it for today. I will see you next time. Bye.